No, the battle for supremacy in Mount Kenya continued to escalate with Deputy President Rigathi Gashagwa's allies firing back at the 48 rebel MPs who dissociated themselves from the second in command. Speaking at a roadside rally in Nyeri town after accompanying the Deputy President to the Agricultural Society of Kenya show, the allies led by Nyandaro Senator John Medhu and Embakasi Central MP Major Dong also fired at President William Ruto warning of consequences if Rikathi Gashagwa is pushed out of the government. He said this in a call that is Major Dong. There is someone with an agenda to divide Mount Kenya. If you see a dog, someone must be holding the leash. This message is for the leash holder. Tie your puppets or forget about Mount Kenya. End of quote. Don't further question whether Shago continued to be backed up against Kuna despite him agreeing to accommodate the Orange Democratic Movement ODM into the government. Don't say this in a court. They brought in Raila into the government and we accepted. What does that have to do with regard this position? End of court. Taking cue from his colleague, John Medu warned that any attempt to force out Gashago from the government will be met with a similar level of resistance. He said this in a court that is Medu. Whatever they decide to do, we will respond. We woke up early to vote for you. We are not going to be kicked out. End of quote. Gashagwa allies also seized the opportunity to pile on National Assembly Majority Leader and Kikuyu MP Kimone Ishungwa, the accused of leading the charge to isolate Gashagwa from the government. They said this in a quote. Contain your mouth. You speak too much. This was from Senator Medu. Fearing back at the 48 MPs who declared Interior Cabinet Secretary Kiduri Kindiki as their direct link to the executive, Medu dismissed the significance of the Nyahururu Declaration, asserting that Gashagwa continues to enjoy the popular backing among the Mount Kenya population. This is a Cuba news.